kind of want to go over how I did this portrait here. A lot of the times I don't get the best pictures. This one was really blurry to do. But um, we had fun with it. And it turned out pretty good. So let me walk you through it a little bit. So the way it starts, um, I'm kind of just doing an outline of everything on my iPad. And uh, I'm just kind of guessing and seeing around where I think everything is. With a blurry picture, it's extra hard because the lines aren't very clear. You don't know where to put things. Um, if you can see, I made a mark by the eye over here. Um, now what I'm doing is I'm kind of going back. I'm turning things on and off, and I'm rechecking everything. So with the portrait, I'm going over this a few times to recheck it. After I kind of have a pretty good sense of it, um, I'll add the extra elements. This one had a frame around it, and I also added a saw and a hammer to the bottom of that. So yeah, you can see that pretty simple. I just sized them up exactly the right size, so they're both the same height. I outlined those, and then we went back into it and uh, put everything together. I ended up making the frame a little bit bigger to fit more of this wood texture, but uh, overall it turned out pretty good. He was really happy with it, and I was glad that I could actually work with this blurry picture. Um, I'm going to do more of these, so if you guys want to let me know what kind of stuff you want to know about, see what kind of process or which part of the process you want me to explain, uh, I can do a few more of these, and that might be cool. So. Yeah, hit me up with the comments or uh, message me. Thanks.